Welcome to this week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment. Locate. Learn. Set up. Hunt. Brought to you by Muddy Outdoors. A lot of people worry about the disturbance that it creates when you come in and do these plots. And that's just part of life. You know, we came in, we had to fence this, and we've been building the plot. We're running late, we're almost running out of time to seed, so it's almost August, we're just barely getting seed in the ground, and the season opens in a month. Is that gonna affect the deer? It probably is. But the way we're looking at it, and, and there's a good deer here to hunt, so it's gonna affect how we hunt that deer for sure. But the way we look at it is the long-term net benefit for the deer. So this year we got behind, we didn't get the seeded in time, we're doing everything late, it's gonna bother the deer, it's gonna set our season back hunting here. But at the end of the day, when you look at next year, the year after, and the years going forward in the future, this plot in this area is gonna improve the habitat here for the deer in such a great way that it's worth the sacrifice now. So deer are really adaptable. I don't think it's gonna take them that long to become accustomed to all the work we did here. At the end of the day, it's long-term gains. And that's your Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment for the week. This week's Canadian Whitetail Scouting segment has been brought to you by Muddy Outdoors. Share your own muddy moment.